Sanctuary policies create a magnet for illegal immigration, especially among those who have committed crimes in the United States. Violation of these federal laws could result in the loss of federal funds for sanctuary city jurisdictions in Wisconsin. Loss of these funds could lead to state and local taxpayers having to fill this gap. It does not make mo local law enforcement officers act as immigration enforcement agents, and it does not require local law enforcement to go out looking for people who entered the United States illegally. Nor is it meant to harm law-abiding immigrants in Wisconsin. I know our president-elect says right now the only people that are going to be picked up with immigration are the bad hombres. Well, is that true? No. It's taking everybody and everything until the fabric of this nation will be destroyed because we're a nation of immigrants. This bill does not deserve the light of day. We contribute to this state. We contribute to this country. No human is illegal. Every one of you sitting in that chair came from an immigrant family. We need our leaders within the state to, to uh, lobby our members of Congress and Senate and our president to embrace comprehensive immigration reform that expedite citizenship for those individuals in our country who wish to become productive members. And I hope that we will give this the due consideration it deserves and have us an opportunity to scale back on the rhetoric and to use this as an opportunity to show that Madison and the rest of our state is all about access and inclusivity for all of our citizens and not citizens, our residents, our constituents, whatever their legal classification or status may be.